Hey there, and welcome back with the Real Crimes. Jack the Ripper. We're back. Continue. Come on. We need to tune you need to pick out similar pairs of letters that match to prove they were penned by the same hand. I mean, just saying. I was saying all weird. That joke. The ooh, ooh, ooh. Bam. Bam. Bam! Wow. Bam! No, wait, no. Bam. Bam. Bam! So the handwriting is a match. This proves that Walter Sickert appears to have written at least some of the original Ripper letters. Many believed the letters to be a hoax at the time, but now I am not so sure. I must say, the evidence so far certainly seems to incriminate Sickert. I don't know what's happened. Okay, I don't need to read that. Okay, McNaughton's office. Splendid. That's the first two murders investigated. Now we need to find the rest of these confounded case files. It's like a... To continue our investigation, tongue twister. Confounded case files to continue our... I don't know. I would call it something else, but... So, case file, case file, case file. I should have read that. Apparently that's that. Is that a case file? No. Um, okay. Uh, let's see. Case file, ink bottle. You're not an ink bottle. No, you an ink bottle. You're an ink bottle. Camera. Camera. Three cameras. Okay, that's a lot of cameras. That's not a camera, is it? O opera gla Oprah glasses. Opera glasses. Those little glasses. Oh, yeah. Where's those little binocular things? Oh, that's... An ink was uh, okay, never mind. A uh, padlock. What's that? Oh, I got the ring apparently. I thought it was a padlock. Okay, a dagger. A rook. That's a chess piece. Oh. What was that? Oh, it was a camera. There's another case file. Case file for Catherine Eddowes. Um. Oh, jeez. Gosh dang it, I gotta go to the bathroom now. You guys don't care, but still. Watch the opera glasses. Oh, jeez. That's a microscope. Uh, 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 yeah. Or no, those are, those are handcuffs. Okay. I can opera. Camera. Okay, um... Mm. Opera glasses, two daggers. Uh, that's not a dagger, is it? There's a padlock. There's dagger. Oh, that's a dagger. That was like a sword. Wait, what was the thing in this game would have a difference between a dagger and a sword? Uh, shoot. Dagger. No, I've seen opera glasses. Look at the mail after this. I saw the mail guy come. Ooh. Okay. Fingerprint. It, it is. Those are. Oh, those are just binoculars! I do wish Inspector Aberloin would stop leaving files to get all over my office. It's a devil to find them sometimes. Nevertheless, I have the next two case files now, so let's go and check out the crime scenes. Which one should I go to? Catherine Eddowes. Mitre Street. Mitre. 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 Like Nitre. Catherine Eddowes, a.k.a. Kate Kelly, was killed in Mitre Square between 1.35 a.m. and 1.45 p.m. a.m. on Sunday 3rd. <laughs> this was the second of the scene of the second of the two murders carried out in the early hours of September 30th uh, by that of Catherine Eddowes. Some believe the Ripper was scared away during the first murder of the night. Before he could finish his gruesome work, so he presumably had to take a second victim to satisfy his hunger. He's not an animal, he's just a person. A terrible person, duh. Okay, is there a seal somewhere? It's gotta be a seal. Yep, seal fragment. Okay, boots. No. Pigeon. Fox. No. I'm actually gonna read it now. Surgeon's bag. Uh, surgeon's bag. Those are those little, like, class packs. Yeah, that one. The surgeon's bag seems like an odd place to discuss such an expensive bag. I mean, bottles, bottle, bottle.
cat. Cat. A rolling pin right there. Broom, broom, broom. Uh, there's a broom. A uh, rats. Okay. A uh, rat. A uh, rat. Well, there's a bottle. And a rat. Do I need a horseshoe, maybe? No. Okay, brass knuckles. Whoa. Seal fragment. Oh, the brass. There's a cuddle. A squid, not a cuddlefish. Don't try to be fancy. Just a stupid cuddlefish. Squid. Cartwheel. Bread. Okay, bread. Br That's not bread. Bread. That's potato, isn't it? Potato. Bread, bread. That's bread. Okay, I need a rake and a cartwheel. This music is so intense for such an unintense game. Fingerprint. Okay. Oh, and I need the release form. Is that the release form? Yep. This paper shows Kathleen Adams was released from the local PlayStation just before she was murdered. Okay, so a rake and a cartwheel, huh? So we're gonna make the Ripper in the end, because she wasn't caught. What? I just got... What did I just get? Apparently that was a cartwheel. Show me the rake. I want some cake. Actually, I don't want cake right now. But it rhymed, so I was like, okay, I want cake. Oh, that thing. You know, Mac, there seems to be more and more signs of a medical person being involved in these murders. Moreover, that bag clearly belongs to a prominent surgeon. I'm beginning to think you're correct, Galton. You may be, this release form shows that Eddowes is released from the local police station shortly before her murder, so there may be some clues there. You guys are really suspicious of everything. Oh, that pub. He, they were in the pub. It's the, there's obviously clues. Do you honestly think we'll have any clues left in a police station? Perhaps, for example, the killer could have stalked his victim from her here that killed her, then killed her, lest, lest we forget this was the last place she was seen alive. Mason, M Masonic Cufflink. It's right there. His cufflinks must have blinded. Oh my god, this is a, I'm gonna, it's so going to be a Freemason murder. Fingerprint. Hacksaw. Okay, that's a saw. Just a saw. Any saw. Hacksaw. Um, a rest sheet. One of these things. No. Keys? Okay, I'm guessing I have to find a bunch of keys. And what was that? A pile of memos. Did you get the memo? No. Well, I guess I'll fax it to you. Oh, another ta ma Masonic tank. Oh, that's just a, a hint. There's the Masonic tankard. Police helmet, police helmet. I like the police helmets in England. They're cool looking. Camera. Key. Key ring. Card. Key. That's not a key, that's a gun. What am I doing? Card. What? Is that not a card? What did I... What is that? A hacksaw, okay. Just click on everything suspicious. Key. Key. Baton. Saxophone. Key ring. Mob. Key. Key. And a card, huh? I see it. And I got all the fingerprints. <laughs> Interesting to find these cufflinks, which is for maybe some Masonic connection to these merch. Or you got some Masonic... Never mind. Kathleen Eddowes' arrest sheet also says she was arrested outside the 10 Bell's Pub for being drunk and disorderly. Guess that's our next stop. Boy, well, how do you know you don't got some Masonic, um... Guy, cops in there? Well, I don't know. Well, here we are, and yet another CD butler looking for clues. This case really is going to depress. CD bars are good bars. What's a surgeon card? 
pan. That's a pan, isn't it? No? Well, what's a pan? Pan is a very general description. Okay, uh, bottles. That's easy. They're everywhere. That's a glass, not a bottle. Duh. Boot! There's a boot right there. Pipe. Where'd the pipe go? I saw the pipe earlier. Uh, pipe, 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 pipe. Violin, that shouldn't be overly hard. It's a violin for crying out loud. Violin. Tankards. Oh, tank, tankard. 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 That's not a tankard. That a tankard. That's a tankard. Sickle. Sickle. Knife. Jew, Jew. That jewelry. That's jewelry. That's jewelry. Okay, now I just need a knife. Is that a knife? No, no, no. That's a hatchet. Uh, knife, 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 and surgeon's card. I don't know what a surgeon's card. Is that it? Oh, yep. Okay, a surgeon to Her Majesty the Queen. Knife. This is a surprise to find the royal surgeon's card here. I can't think what business you would have in this part of London. I fear you must pay him a visit to establish if and why he was here. Okay, so, uh, my, from my guess, there's, like, a couple of these things. There's, like, three or four of these. Good day to you, Dr. Gull. And then they have, like, like, a little puzzle thing. So, Dr. Gull, we are we investigating the Ripper case and wonder if you could help us with our investigations. I thought that case was closed from what I remember. The police never found the culprit, and yet the murder stopped. It's true, but we are reviewing the case and following up on some new leads. Tell me, Doctor, have you ever visited the Whitechapel area of East, in East End London? No, sir, it's not a place I care to venture, and what's more, I have neither business nor pleasure interests there. Oh, pleasure, no. Thank you, Dr. Gold. We won't take up any more of your valuable time, but can we take a brief look around your medical premises? Then we will be on our way. Club car, is that a club? No. What's that? Oh, cufflink. What is it not the suspicious dude with a bunch of knives in his house? I guess he's a surgeon, so. It's kind of different. I'm just clicking on things. I don't even know what I'm like. That? That's supposed to be there? It looks like there's a hole in that chair. Got a hint. Okay, books three. That's easy. One, two, three. There we go. Old membership card for St. James Gentleman Club. Oh, yeah. Microscope, um, saws. I already got one saw. Fingerprint. Saw, saw, saw. I saw you. Different types of saws, huh? Gonna be tricky that way. Okay. What? Half a head. Oh. Saw. One more saw, steak. Steak. That is not good medical practice to leave a steak around your office, mister. Is that a saw? Yes. No, it wasn't. Ink bottle. I need one more ink bottle. There's an ink bottle. That's not a saw. No, I, no. No, it's a syringe. One more syringe. That's a saw. No, that's a knife. Appointment book. I don't see a saw. Oh, saw. I saw that. That's interesting. This may sound a cufflink matches the one we found in the police station. It appears Dr. Gold is a member of the Freemasons. They may have been near the scene of Catherine Eddowes' murder after all. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. It also looks like Dr. Gold is a member of the St. James Gentleman Club's. I say there appears to be a list of numbers on the back of the card. I have a feeling this might be the combination to a safe. Perhaps this is the one hidden in the gentleman's club. Woo, let's go to the gentleman's club. Woo, 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 woo. St. James Gentleman's Club. Okay, let's see if we can find this hidden safe. Another girl really does, in fact, have something to hide. Portrait. That's a portrait. Wow, found it. So I have to find this stuff? What the? Okay, spear. There's a spear. Bottle. Bottle. Bottle, bottle. Like, I, it makes me find bottles a lot. 
I don't know why. Apparently, this game, they like, whoever made this really likes bottles. So I was like, find a bottle, buddy. Pipe. Sausage. Sausage. Why is that so weird to me? That I will find the sausage. Africa. Oh, Africa. Oh, I got a hint. Pipe, sausage. Pipe. It's a croissant. Why am I clicking on it? Sausage. Ball. Is that a ball? Yes. Corks. Or just cork. What? Oh, cork. Never mind. I need to watch my time right now, sorry. Um cork, 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 cork. Just say cork like eighty times. It sounds kinda weird. Cork. Okay, ring and a flute. Is that a flute? No, that's a clarinet. Where's a flute? Okay, ring. There's a ring there. Flute, flute, flute. Toot on the flute. Flute, flute, flute. That's a flute. There. God, we found. Good, we found the safe. Now see if these numbers will open it. Doesn't look as if these numbers will work after all. Nonsense, Galton. I'm sure they must work. Though it appears to be a rather complex lock, each number must be input to the correct position in exactly the right order, or the lock will reset. Guess we have to work out what it is. No. 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 Sorry. No. 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 May I start at the bottom? I don't know. Okay, sorry guys. I'm really distracted right now, but. No. What? Okay. One. No. One. Okay, I'm gonna end this probably after this because it's gonna take a while. One five, one five, one five, one five. Okay. One six, one six, one six. I already did that. No. One six, one. I didn't even put it in. One, six, one, two, one, two, one, two, three, four. No, wait, one, oops, sorry, one, two, three. Four. No. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good, cracked it. Let's see what we have inside. Interesting. It appears we sent sort of medical document. My word, this document is a medical history for Prince Albert Victor. It says he has a terrible sickness, which is making him mentally unstable, and the doctor fears he may be violent and dangerous. It's a very sensitive document indeed. 
Dalton, Queen Victoria would hate for this to become public knowledge. This whole Ripper case is becoming more and more twisted. Twisted. No! Resume. Mac, you sure you don't think the prince has any involvement in the murders, do you? So that would be a terrible scandal to bring upon the monarchy. Ah, I broke it. I don't know. If something is off here, I'm sure Gull was lying to me when he said he'd never visited Whitechapel. Well, yeah, we, well, we have the surgeon's bag and cufflinks we found. If you take it to my lab, we can use a new technique I had to develop to, to test them for fingerprints. 